The family of a Manhattan Beach Alzheimer's patient who'd been missing for years is finally getting some closure tonight. We just learned remains found in Fossil Ridge Park in Sherman Oaks last year are confirmed to be those of Nancy Palikas. KCAL 9's Joy Benedict is live in Manhattan Beach with the latest. Joy. Yeah, this is certainly not to the end of this story that folks here in this Manhattan Beach community have been looking for. Nancy Palakis went missing more than two years ago, but finally the news came that she was not coming home. I need to find her and uh, make sure I can take care of her. It has been a desperate search for more than two years as Kirk Moody spoke out time and time again, hoping someone had seen his wife. I mean, she's the love of my life and so far I've let her down. But even after the reward was raised and the months went on, there was no sign of Nancy Palakis. The retired computer engineer was seen on security video in October of 2016 walking away from LACMA, the Los Angeles County Museum of Art, then walking down the street. Palakis was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's the year before and was unable to speak, and she seemed to just vanish. But the coroner's office released the worst news possible for this family that she had died. Remains were first found by firefighters at this park in Sherman Oaks, seven miles from where she went missing in March of 2017 after a small brush fire. Then more remains were found just a few months ago, and both samples sent to a lab at the California Department of Justice. That lab just confirmed confirmed the bones belonged to Palakis. In addition to searching for his wife, Moody helped form LA Found, a county resource for loved ones with cognitive impairments. County Supervisor Janice Hahn worked on the project and expressed her condolences on social media. I am heartbroken. For two years, we have kept hope alive that she would be found safe. Her husband, Kirk, has been incredibly brave, and I want to thank him for his work creating LA Found in the hope that no one else will have to go through what Nancy did. May she rest in peace. Now, although we do know that the remains found belong to Nancy Palakis, we don't know exactly how she died. And that investigation is still underway by the Los Angeles County Coroner's Office, as well as the Los Angeles Police Department. I did speak with her husband early this morning. He was out of town. He's on his way back here to Manhattan Beach later on this evening. But he tells me, although this is not the ending that he wanted, it is an ending, and that is what he needs.